Hello everyone. Welcome to UIAS. Let's discuss Shorya missile. Shorya missile. Among the top 10 missiles in its class with advanced navigation systems, propulsion system and control technologies. Surface to surface supersonic Shorya strategic missile. K5 submarine launched ballistic missile. Two stage solid propellant. Shorya means bravery. It is a canister-launched hypersonic surface-to-surface -surface tactical missile developed by the Indian Defence Research and Development Organisation (DRDO) for use by the Indian Armed Forces. It has a range of 700 to 1,900 kilometers (430 to 1,180 mi). It is capable of carrying a payload of 200 to 1,000 kilograms conventional or nuclear warhead. It gives the potential to strike at very long range against any adversary. The first flight test was conducted in 2004. Shorya Missile Shorya is a land variant of short-range submarine-launched ballistic missile, SLBM, K-15 Sagarika, which has a range of at least 750 kilometers. Capable of carrying payloads of 200 kilograms to 1,000 kilograms. It is a surface-to-surface -surface tactical missile. These ballistic missiles belong to the K-missile family. It is named after late Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam. Launched from Arihant class of nuclear submarines. Shorya, like many of the modern missiles, is a canister-based system, which means that it is stored and operated from specially designed compartments. The missile is less vulnerable to anti-ballistic missile defense systems due to its high maneuverability. It also houses the gas generator to eject the missile from the canister before its solid propellant motors take over to hurl it at the intended target. At Definite Expo 2010, the missile was displayed without the container shroud mounted on a land mobile erector launcher. Shorya missiles can remain hidden or camouflaged in underground silos from enemy surveillance or satellites till they are fired from the special storage cum launch canisters. If put in silos, the DRDO scientists said that given Shorya's limited range at present, the silos will have to be constructed closer to India's borders or an extended range version will have to be developed. Defense scientists say the high speed, to stage Shorya is highly maneuverable which also makes it less vulnerable to existing anti-missile defense systems. It is a rocket-propelled self-guided strategic weapons system that follows a parabolic trajectory to deliver a payload from its launch site to a predetermined fixed target. Ballistic missiles of India, Agni, K-4, SLBM, Prahar, Dhanush, Prithvi and Trishul. Ballistic missiles are means to rapidly and accurately deliver a lethal payload to a target. The lethal payload can include conventional explosives and a biological, chemical or nuclear warhead. The propulsion system of the Shorya uses a two-stage solid propellant to attain a speed of Mach 7.5 and a flight altitude of 40 km. The hypersonic speed of the missile offers a minimal chance of getting destroyed by any interceptor missile. For an upcoming new version of the missile system will include better operational range, accuracy and increased payload capability. Improvement in speed offers better chances of avoiding interceptors and striking the target with minimal time. India conducted two major missile tests. The first was the hypersonic weapon Shorya and the second was the Agni P missile. According to this, staggering speed means the Shorya missile can cover entire 700 kilometers in less than 500 seconds, which makes it impossible for enemy radars or anti missile defenses. The Shorya missile is designed to provide Indian armed forces with long range missile strike capability. Hypersonic weapons such as Shorya are likely to be highly effective in taking out enemy early radars, static military installations such as airbases and command and control facilities. 
Shorya uses a gas generator to eject the missile out of the canister. Its launcher is a Tatra BML 8x8 truck. This platform is also used by other missile systems, such as the Prithvi. Thank you, everyone. Do subscribe to this channel. Use code SPLIVE to join an academy.